Wilmington police are cracking down on distracted driving here in the port city. But just what exactly does it mean to be a distracted driver? WWY's Taylor Yakowenko joins us now to explain. It's the big story at 11. Hi, Taylor. Good evening, Amanda. According to police, anything from having a snack to changing the radio station can fall into the category of distracted driving. And Corporal Adam Schwartzel with the WPD Traffic Unit says it's a major problem for Wilmington. The majority of our crashes are rear end crashes at traffic lights. The majority of them are because of inattention. Officers with the Wilmington Police Department are cracking down on distracted drivers across the city. Or whether it's eating, um, using your GPS, changing the songs on your iPod, anything that takes your attention off driving is a distraction. Corporal Adam Schwartzel says the goal of the crackdown is to educate folks on the dangers of not paying attention. We got the entire unit out. Uh, we're working these major thoroughfares like College Road behind me um, to make sure that as many people as we can see that are uh, distracted while they're driving to kind of educate them and let them know, hey, it's probably not the safest thing to do. And some Wilmington drivers agree with police. They say there are a lot of cars on the road who don't necessarily have their eyes on the road. I don't think necessarily that's a generational thing. I don't think it's just millennials like some people like to say with millennials and texting. I see um, people my parents age and even a couple of granny and granddaddies. Some even say bad drivers are something Wilmington is known for. But I think we get a, a bad rap for having a lot of bad drivers here. Um, and I de I've definitely seen my fair share of um, crazy drivers and um, scary incidents that have happened. So police are hoping this new plan will put a stop to some of that and keep us safer on our roads. Schwartzel says it is also against the law to check your phone even when you're at a red light, which is something a lot of us are guilty of. He says if the vehicle is in operation, using your phone is off limits. Amanda. Good information. Thanks, Taylor.